meteorologist Brian Nisnanski. Last night, late last night, we had a very light wintry mix move across the southern end of the Fox Valley. It wasn't much, but it might be enough to still have a couple slick spots on the roads this morning. Also, we had the melting snow yesterday that could be freezing up as well. So give yourselves a couple extra minutes on the way to work or school this morning. It won't be much, and you can kind of see that glaze a little bit here along College Avenue in Appleton. 25, the current temperature in Appleton. Temperature-wise, we're off to a very nice start. 23 currently in Green Bay. It's 26 in Shawano, 28 in Oshkosh, even a 30 uh, this morning in Fond du Lac. Here's your temperature trend. These are the highs of the next seven days. And today and tomorrow will be way above normal. The normal high is 29. We'll go with 37 for today, 36 tomorrow. And then we dive back down well below normal uh, this weekend. And especially next week looks very cold. We'll show you that on the 10 day. Here's your forecast highlights. A beautiful day expected for today. Today looks gorgeous, almost just like yesterday. In fact, probably more sun and a couple degrees warmer. Tomorrow, not so nice. We have a big winter storm shaping up to the southwest of us that will move in here tomorrow and into tomorrow night. As of right now, I think most of us will start with a brief period of snow and sleet tomorrow morning, then change over to rain and freezing rain through much of the day tomorrow before changing back over to heavy snow tomorrow night. Let's break it all down here. Here's your Midwestern satellite and radar. You can see the clear skies right now across the Midwest. We have an area of high pressure. High pressure will keep our weather quiet today. That all changes again by tomorrow. Let's go through time. High pressure during the day today and into this afternoon. Mostly sunny skies. Tonight, here comes our area of low pressure down to the south of us. And you can see already by tomorrow at 6 a.m., a uh, wintry mix starting to move in here just south of the area. And that will move in here as we head into tomorrow. Again, I think it starts as snow and sleet and then changes over to more of a freezing rain mixture during the day tomorrow uh, before this is 6 o'clock. And you can see that pink shade indicating that mix of precipitation. And then as we head into the late evening hours tomorrow night, everybody changes back over uh, to some snow. As far as the snow amounts, as of right now, it looks like just one to three inches east of Green Bay in the Fox Valley. From Green Bay, Fox Valley, and to the northwest, three to six inches of snow. And then northwest of Shawano, six to 12 inches of snow. But even the locations that have the lighter amounts of snow could end up with more ice. So it still could be quite nasty. Here are the one weather alerts. Again, we have a winter storm watch northwest of Green Bay in the Fox Valley. Winter weather advisory down to the south. You may be thinking, what's going on here in Green Bay, Fox Valley, and the Lakeshore? I think most of us will be added to at least an advisory, if not a winter storm watch, later on today as the storm gets a little bit closer. So again, for storm updates, you can always track the storm online, NBC26.com, and find us on Facebook on NBC26 as well. Your forecast for today, mostly sunny skies, a high temperature of 37. For tonight, 27 increasing clouds with a chance of snow late tonight. And again, into tomorrow, things will be very slick on the roads. 36 for your high tomorrow, 25 on Friday. Some snow could linger early on Friday. Should we even mention next week yet? <laughs> Not yet. Let's get through tomorrow okay. first. Tomorrow's Sounds gonna good. be bad enough. We'll wait. <laughs> it gets cold next week. We'll just say that. But well, uh, we'll... as of right now, tomorrow uh, looks just kind of like one of those really nasty days. Definitely stay up on that yeah. for your